As a photographer coming to New York, you know, an agency can really make or break you. Scheduling wise, you know, I know that there's probably going to be a problem, whatever, but are they here at the moment or are they away? Paris right? is in Paris now, mm -hmm. so we'll check her option through the Paris office because they hold the char. Anya, she was just here for Met Ball, but she left for London last night. She'll be back next week. Fantastic. If I don't get the right girls for this project, and the right models at the certain level I want, then it's not gonna have the cut through. I won't get the, the well, I'll, I would get images with girls that weren't as sort of strong, but in terms of getting profile and attention for the project, for the cause, uh, you know, I really need to be working with the girls at a certain level. And, you know, I, they have to be the very best in the industry. That's, the, that's what I'm trying to do with this. I'm trying to make this the very best it can be. Well, I'll talk to you about scheduling and see what we can organize. I mean, I know the timing is valuable, so maybe we can, if we could potentially get two on one day, or we can just do it with one. Every girl in this project is, uh, is not the easiest girl to get. We never make it that easy. They're in super high demand. We are very specific about who photographs them, unless it's uh, you know the best people in the industry or there's a lot of money involved. So what about Irina? Because I think she's, she's, I mean, she's just such an iconic, beautiful, beautiful girl. You know, I think with Irina, um, she's so uh, particular about uh, showing her skin, uh -huh. uh, you know, so it just has, I don't know if she's gonna do nudity, um, and there's so many different um, people I need to go through. Right. Um, but I think that she as well is gonna really like the project, so it's just a matter of explaining to her what it is so that we can um, get her to sign up for it. You know, here in New York, you know, the seasons are just incredible. And when I really wanted to sort of think about capturing spring and what spring meant as a season to me and as an idea, you know, I chose to go to Central Park because there's a very short period of time where these amazing blossoms and magnolia trees actually come into full bloom. And it's only about a two week window, but it's just so incredible. Eniko is such an amazing girl with such a beautiful face and a really incredible energy. We're working with one of my favorite makeup artists, Dottie. She's an old friend of mine from Australia and she really brings so much to the table. She's so talented and she really gets the inspiration of nature. What we're shooting, it's gonna be sort of like, you know, dramatic close-ups on her as well with all, the, with all the magnolias and blossoms behind her as well. She's wearing white, very sort of ethereal, backlit, flary. Mm -hmm. I was thinking like a white and eye white and pink and it goes into the brow and it's really brushed up and it's very organic and it's very soft and you'll still be able to see the flesh through. I want that to become a huge highlight piece. How did you go with the dress? Problem. So basically we got this the perfect dress. The perfect dress is with the stylist. Mm. The stylist is not picking up his phone and he is MIA. We're about to start shooting and we desperately, desperately need this dress because it's the number one favourite. Um, can you call me back on my cell phone? When you get on the shoot day, there's always something that's going to come up that you've got to deal with. You've got to sort of be able to just effortlessly move into another option. This, I mean, it's a beautiful dress for sure. And this is also really great in terms of seeing light through. This is beautiful, like when it's backlit. Well, yeah, let's we'll try and track that, that one down, down and we'll, yeah, well. we'll see how we go. All right, Dot. What are you waiting for? Oh, there's a dress, the one dress that I really wanted to use, the stylist has disappeared with it. Doesn't matter. The work around it. The universe provides different things. Ah, the weather was just not actually cooperating with us. It was completely freezing. And she was such an incredible girl to be able to go up there and actually, you know, go out in this freezing cold weather in, in a bitterly cold wind and actually move around and do this work. Use the other arm up high in the, in the tree behind you. The other one. Yeah, beautiful. Oh, 
strong. <laughs> exactly. Get that, show me that. Get up again. Try to lose this here. In my hands, right here. Thank you. Well done, love. Worked out? All right, guys. Yep. Huh? Worked out? <laughs> I bet you said workout. I'm like, fuck, I'm already worked out, man. Yeah, no, it's beautiful. <laughs>